joy be with us that we become holy and righteous. Amen? Balaan o pag-aaral o pag-aaral. When we gather at SRP this coming March 19, that's my birthday. We'll also share with our clergy about Pagsangyaw 2021. And that's why we who know will also be strengthened simply ang atong kapalian din eh. Because they give time for this Pagsangyaw 2021. But also of the many other priests who will gather. Because if today we launch Pagsangyaw 2021, on March 19, those who will attend the retreat, I'm sure there are those who will treat me. I will ask them there now. Not because it's my birthday, but because the Lord has called all of us, all of us, let this Potsangyal 2021 be our offering to the Lord until 2021. Amen. Amen. We have many other offerings. But what I'd like to underline is tungod kay sakto. Some people think that only the priests are the more proper or the priests are those the mission trusted proclaim preach evangelization. Today I'd like to say that's fake news. <laughs> that is not true. Why? Because Santo Pa now don't be poor. But especially with Vatican II, especially with PCP II, especially with Christian Fidelis Aichi, we are reminded they people, they people are trusted by the Lord to proclaim the good news. Amen. That's why today you will make a commitment, not to me, but to the Lord, because by baptism, by baptism, we are the mission. We are called to be proclaimers of the good news. Amen? Amen. 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 Lord, who sana, as we shall call my guy, total first voice come on now. Final, final point. I'm happy we send Laos, Laos and Moses now, but because we are, you are there. So I know. It is not my God, so I'm but I'm happy because now we made the huge effort from the perspective of the fact that we know better. Amen. Now we made this huge effort from the fact that we feel in Cebu. We feel privileged. Amen. Amen. Hindi na higit nagsugod ang Kristyanismo sa Pilipinas. Amen? Hindi man ang first baptism. Amen. Hindi man ang planting of the cross. Amen. Hindi man ang gift of Senor Santo Nino. Amen. And that's why we are called the cradle of Christianity in the Philippines. Amen. Amen. Ano wala ang logo? Pwede mo mo doon o pwede na mo mo ulit. No, I mean, we should be grateful. We start with a renewed perspective. Kagibuhan na ito, kini, tungod sa atong malipayon ng pagpasalamat sa Diyos, kasa sa pagtubo. Amen? Buhatong na ito, kini, tungod sa atong pagtubo, kagitawag kita sa ginoon. The gift we receive is the gift we share. Amen? Tumor kay natuo kita at we own 
gifted of Him. Amen. Tungkol kay na duho kita, we are blessed in order to bless others. Amen. Mao, nga karong at lawa, this mass is actually a commissioning. Meaning, as your humble servant, the name of the Archdiocese, we are telling you that they start this joyful initiative to make other people realize that we are happy to be Catholics. Amen. That we are happy that the Lord shared with us this gift, this privilege. Amen. Take note, pass forward. Tanawa, may saan po sa ko, banat lagi ako. Jokes like this. Tomorrow, the gospel is transfiguration. Just take note. Among the messages meaning the gospel is when Jesus was transfigured, the gang message, but in the prayer we see that this Jesus who was transformed and revealed his glory is also a picture of what we will become because Dili lamang si Jesus, pero kitang tanan anak sa Diyos. Amen? And pass forward, we are also hinting the time will come. And that's also the glory we will share. Dito na tako ba ni Jesus sa Himayang sa Diyos ang mahal. Amen? Wag ka nito. And so today, even here, when we sing the Our Father, we are already claiming we are all children of God. And one day we will share the fullness of that glory of our being children in the joys of heaven. What can you do? And that's why the reason why we want to proclaim the love, the mercy, the glory of God is because we are his children. That's why even the gospel says, be holy as your father is holy. And forgive our enemies. We can proclaim the goodness. This too is the reason. Kano nga, ay kamuta. Eh di man lang kita, I no longer call you servants. Jesus was saying, but friends, because I share with you, I have received of the Father. Perhaps Jesus will also say, I call you brothers and sisters because you share with me being children of the Father. That's why when I knock it as a Joseph, I call you a new book. And now what I call you a new book of the Father, but I want to know who. But they will say, we're happy. We're still as we're excited. We play the glory, the mercy, the joy of being a Christian community of being members of the family of God. Amen? Again, pakinig reflection ng 2021. But for today, mas po na nagdagang salamat for coming over because, as it were, mga excited na magdawa, let's start the game, no? Let's start the mission. Let's start the proclamation. And then, Ikonag is Lord. Tama na, as we shall pay, Pabos ka naman, no? Because there are many of your sisters and brothers who certainly coming from here will start the proclamation to the glory of God and also to the joy of those who hunger for God and wants to listen to the good news of this Christian faith. That we have. Amen. And yung tanan, sagam salamat. May the Lord bless our efforts. After all, this is God's work. After all, this is the work of the Spirit. Instrument to kita sa gino, but we trust that if we do our own share, 
of ministry. Because this is God's work, then God will bless this work with surprises beyond our imagination. And yung tanan, sa atong pagpadayang ni Ibi, is made this commitment and this prayer that our little efforts to bring about the glory of God and the growth of the church in our country, but in a special way in our beloved Diocese of Cebu. Once more, Kenyong Tanan, Nagang Salamat, God bless you.